My dear viewers, I just realized something. If I'm in my room and I'm thinking about what should I vlog about, I'll find that I just start talking. And I just start scripting my vlog without actually writing any of it down. But you see, the problem is, I never usually use that script that I came up with in my head. I just sort of talk and I talk and I talk. And I come up with this fantastic thing. These things that just sound great when I say them, but when I try to say them to a camera and with jump cuts and all that, it just doesn't work. So this time I decided I'll just start my camera and I'll just record myself talking about whatever the hell I want to talk about. And you see, I just had a very nice conversation with Kate Berger. That person. And, and I realized that <laughs> when I just go into these tangents, uh, I, mean, I, I mean, I sound crazy, and I, I really think that's a good way to approach people. Okay, maybe it's not a good way to approach people, but it's a good way to approach doing what you love, just doing it how you feel you, sh you usually do it. I mean, still, this video is going to take a lot of editing, and I'm not going to like that, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do it anyway. So I'm going to talk about music. You see, lately, the past couple of years, music has saved me from going completely out of my mind. It's kept me just thinking logically, thinking as though I'm not totally crazy. <laughs> but you see, uh, when I'm just talking to myself like this, I, I really am kind of crazy. Because, uh, I mean, uh, if you're listening to me, you can hear. I'm just babbling, it doesn't make any sense. I mean, I, I guess everybody is crazy to some degree, but I think I'm a little crazier than most people are crazy. Now, I've been really, really interested in music for the past few years, and it's just... I mean, when I play something on the guitar or the piano, it's great, but I've realized lately that when I'm with a couple of people, and we don't have any instruments, and we're just singing, and like, creating our own harmonies, and just doing it for fun, I mean, it's, it's, it's fantastic, it, it's just like this feeling that you can't recreate with any instrument, I mean, that's what I love about acapella music, it's just so, it's pure from the body, from the soul, it's the best thing. I mean, this is how music was before instruments were created. People would, they would, they would sing. They would come up with these melodies, and and, th and they would figure out that if you sing this pitch and then you sing this pitch simultaneously, it would sound really, really nice. And then when you added this pitch, it would sound even better. And that probably wasn't a fifth anyway. But and that's how chords were created, and then people came along, they figured out that if we strung just like the string through something and tightened it, we could create a pitch, and we could hit the pitch and it would make a sound. And if we dragged, if we pinched the string, at some point it would make it higher. If we let it go, it would be lower. And the looser the string is, the lower the note is. And the tighter, the higher it is. And, I mean, it's a great thing to work on. I mean, and it just paved the way for so many instruments. I mean, look at the piano. I mean, it doesn't sound like strings. It sounds uh, completely unique in every single way. It's gorgeous if it's played right. I mean, really gorgeous. And you see, I could just go on about this stuff for hours upon hours, but I can't do that because I have, like, a time limit to 15 minutes on YouTube, and I don't even want to. I 
upload a 15 minute video because people aren't going to watch that and it's going to take an hour to edit and I don't want to do that. You see, I mean I want more than anything right now to just arrange an acapella group with some of the most talented people I know. Like for instance that girl I mentioned earlier, Kate Berger. Just the, she's beyond talented. She is a, this fantastic singer who, who just like, I mean, it's, she doesn't even seem to have to try. And just beautiful noise is coming out of her head, and her, just, she's she's great. You, sh you should check out, check her out. I'll leave an annotation somewhere on this video right now, and you can just check her out. She's very good. Trust me. And really. I just I cannot express in words just how much I love music, just how safe I feel when I'm listening to a song through my iPod, or just how sane I feel when I'm listening to a song through my iPod. It's just kind of changes me. It's like a drug, and I'm addicted to it. I really, I love it. I love it, and that's the least I can say about it. I think this is where I'm going to end this rant, because I just don't want to take up all the space on my memory card, and I don't want to edit, like, a 17-minute long video, so I'll see you guys next time I upload a video. By the way, I've decided, uh, I mean, just the time schedule for uploading videos is, is just not going to work. I'm not going to be able to do it, so I'm just going to upload videos whenever I feel like it, it's going to work, okay? Sorry. And I will upload some sort of music soon, I guess, but... I promise I will upload some sort of music. I mean, I already uploaded just fiddling on the piano the other day, and and some acapella stuff. Like, I mean, that that just arranging that in a couple seconds with Nick oh, that was really fucking cool. Uh, I love that. So, and I'll see you guys later. Okay, I still have a couple minutes, so I'm just going to say I'm not going to edit this video. No, I think it's it's better if I just leave it the way it is. I mean, it feels more personal. I don't know. I just feel like it, it'll be better. And the silence is, will emphasize what I'm trying to say, I guess. Just, just trust me. I, I like it better. It's my style. Unedited.